G'day everyone. This is the second part to the um, buffer pedal that I built. Uh, this will be the sound demo. And I'll just show you a few uses that you can use a buffer with. There's three main uses. The first one is if you've got a long cable chain. I've actually already shown this in another video. A buffer can bring the highs back. And I've found that around the 10 meter mark, uh, it's, it starts to benefit from a buffer, but of course that depends on the quality of the cables that you have as well. The second one is if you've got a lot of true bypass pedals. If you've got a boss pedal on your pedal board, you don't really need to worry because they usually have buffers in it. You'd have to test that and find out for yourself, but um, the, the boss pedals have buffer switching, so um, you can actually use a, bu a, a boss pedal as a buffer. Um, but if you don't, if you've only got true bypass pedals, you will find that the top end starts to get taken off. Um, I think from my test of about a month ago, I think it was about seven or eight pedals where you started to notice that the um, top end started to come off. But I'm going to retest that when I do the um, when I do this demo. And the third one is in conjunction with other pedals, and there are are a few pedals that can actually benefit from um, a buffer being in front of them. They um, sound quite different when you put a buffer in front. So we'll start off with the cable one first. So that last test was with about 15 meters of cables, um, just going straight into the amp. There's no other, um, there's no other pedals or effects on the on the chain, um, and you can hear it's a bit of a probably a bit subtle, but there's definitely an increase in the um, high end. So the next test, I'll just get a bunch of true bypass pedals and um, hook them all up and um, see what difference the uh, buffer makes um, with that sort of setup. So this is with eight pedals and um, I've just found that pretty much around eight where you start to notice the top end well. With these particular eight pedals you start to hear um, the top end um, get taken away. Um, I might do another test with a couple couple of extra pedals so um, I don't know if, if eight pedals on a pedal board is unheard of but if you do have a lot of, if you do use a lot of effects um, you'd probably be wanting to look at getting a a bu or building a buffer because um, uh, um, yeah you start to notice the um, the top end get taken away so this is with eight <laughs> So that was with 10 pedals and you can definitely hear the top end being taken away. I also think you're probably going to get even more top end reduction if you're if I was actually using uh, patch cables instead of these little links because obviously they're very short. They're probably not even adding to the to the to the line, whereas if you actually use patch cables you're adding another length of cable to the line. Um, so it would probably even make the um, uh, make for an even bigger difference. I'll do a couple of um, 
uh, a couple of tests with the buffer and a couple of other pedals um, and show you the difference it makes with those. So you can see a couple of examples there of the buffer actually having an effect on the pedal. Doesn't always make a difference, in fact it probably more often doesn't make a difference than it does, but that's the thing with the buffer. You really have to experiment with it and um, yeah, put it at the front of the chain, put it at the back of the chain um, and you know just um, try different pedals with it. Um, some pedals it, it might actually sort of take away from, some it improves. So yeah, that's the buffer. It's um, like I said in the other video, it's a bit of a question mark as to what it's actually going to do. It um, it can definitely work if you've got a lot of cables uh, or a lot of stop boxes on your um, pedal, or if you're just looking for something to um, experiment with, um, give it a go. It's a pretty easy build if you're looking at building one yourself, and they're not very expensive to buy either. They're pretty cheap. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.